Okay, hello guys, welcome to a new game of Civ here. Going to be continuing our Always War scenario here. Starting a new one on Immortal difficulty. We've been playing, uh, we played on Emperor last time and we beat it with not too many problems. So we're going to crank up the difficulty to Immortal and I'm going to keep it as a Pangea with 6 AI. I wanted to play with Churchill. Um, and he's a charismatic and protective combo for some pretty crazy guys. And charismatic is awesome. Almost as good as financial. Allows your cities to grow like two population larger in the early game, which is a big deal. Especially since we'll be whipping lots and getting our guys out. I think it can be really good. Um, the settings we're playing on are no vassal states, no huts, no events, always war, no tech trading, and that'll do. We're playing with the Buffy mod. You can search that up yourself. And Blue Marble is the interface I'm using. It's an interface mod that makes the game pretty. And yeah, all right. I've played Always War and Immortal quite a few times and I've failed pretty much every single time one way or another. It is not easy. Like, it's honestly harder than a regular DD game. The jump from Emperor to Immortal is actually massive in Always War because the AI has a worker at the start that allows them to save 15 of their early turns instead of, you know, building a worker at size one and then, you know, they have the work and they just start improving their tiles immediately. So it's it's a big jump from Emperor in Always War because the early game is important. Now, later on in the game, it's not much different. You know, once they max out at six or seven cities, they might only be 5% faster attacking after that. Whereas the DD is like 20% faster. Well, not in this case, no. The, the early game is extremely important. And what got me killed was, in like some previous attempts, was people attacking me with chariots at like 2200 BC or swordsmen coming across the map at like 1500 BC. Like it's really early. If you remember on the Emperor game, I don't think I got attacked until like... 800 BC or something with archers and chariots. It's kind of a joke when I had like axes and spears and multiple archers fortified on a hill city that had already gotten border pops and stuff. No, they they come early, like 20 turns earlier. It's going to be tough. Anyway, we'll try to use these traits. That's going to be fun. I think protective is actually really good on always war. I think it's economical as well because it means you, you can build less units to defend with and you are going to be defending the whole game. And you can defend with 10 longbows instead of 15 you know, crappy longbows, right? Because your longbows are going to have city garrison and drill. And then, you know, since you're charismatic, you can get to like drill four really quickly. And you drill four city garrison, one longbow versus just a regular city garrison, two longbow. It's so much better. And they can kill so many guys. And yeah, like 10 longbows is all you really need to until they have rifles and then we just beeline our unique unit and then this is a pretty awesome unit it's a red coat with a bonus versus gunpowder units which effectively removes its weakness against grenadiers and we're protective we're going to be fortified on a hill super promoted by that point nothing is going to stop these guys when we get there not even infantry and cannons stock exchange is a bank with 65 percent extra gold on it going to be really useful in always war because we have our slider down the whole game and we're actually going to be beelining banking for mercantilism because that's our civic since we don't get any trade routes anyway for at war with everybody and fishing and mining can be decent starting techs mining gets you to bronze working which is good for worker turn something to do with your workers and to get to bronze working quicker and fishing speeds up pottery a little bit even if you're inland and wow we have the the start all right one of these i'll take it dude i'll take it i could actually go here if i want 
I think I'll go on the plains hill though. Reporting for duty. Oh, that's pretty nice. Gotta say. Yeah, having gold start does help. No, I need to think about how I want to play this. You could have gold in your capital, yeah? That's nice. But if you're in the middle of everybody and you're next to Shaka and... I don't know... Sitting Bull? Who's gonna fortify dog soldiers in your land at 2000 BC and Shaka Impi Rashi? Could be horrible. We'll see... What happens. We'll go for the Plains Hill for defense. Oh my god. And... yeah. Pretty good roll. I'm lucky. Okay, this appears to be the edge. Now I probably want a city somewhere here to block this bit of land off. Maybe even here if I was crazy, but I'm thinking maybe here. Um... Because I, I see the water there, and I see the water here, so I assume this is just a little peninsula. I don't think there's anyone right here. Almost impossible. All the attacks are going to be coming from here, from here, and from here. This is always war. You have to defend from multiple fronts. We want our capital to be safe as possible. A double food, that's good. I can cottage the plains and I'll be okay. Cottage, 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 cottage. That's a good tile too. This is a really nice capital. Got two luxurious resource, three luxurious resources. One that's really early. And I think I go monarchy and don't worry about the pyramids and just get the wine if I get that far. So we want to get some settlers out quickly. We want to get to archery quickly as well. Well, we can do that. We might go bronze working first, since we have gold, and then archery after that. I think you got to skip animal husbandry though. It's like agriculture, bronze working, chop chop some settlers and archers. Yeah. I want to scout out this area. I mean, I know the jungle's up here. Stone. I want to know where my immediate saddles are going to be. If there's a good spot, I can go way out here to kind of... Oh, shit. Get their attention. Okay, so Kubla is like right here. Yeah, he's really close. I don't think he's here because he has a scout up here at turn 5. Or up here at turn 5, which is like impossible to be here. I think he's like right here. I'll kill that dingus. Try and kill... I just need to kill, like, a panther or something. And I can go steal workers off of him. He must be right there near that X. So I want, I want to go, like, somewhere here to get his attention. Maybe just, like, right there would be okay. Looks like we have... Interesting... Terrain blockage here. Shit. Right. I probably want a city up here too. If, maybe here and work the gold. That would be good. Probably get their attention as well if I go right there. Yeah, that that's that's the spot we want for sure. And there. We want to settle on hills. Get their attention. So those two are going to be my first two cells. It doesn't matter if it's a crap city, I don't care. If this has forests, it has a floodplain I can farm, I can work the gold. It's not actually that bad. This one's a piece of crap, but... I, know, I might go up here. It depends how much I can choke Kubla. Okay, there's a panther. I'm going to heal and fight the panther. I've got lots of animals coming. I'll just go here. Now here's a cool thing. When you actually defend, it's much quicker to heal when you defend than it is... First of all, I'm also fortified in a forested hill here. This panther will get totally owned. But when he when he attacks me, 
I get to heal before my turn starts, I think. Yes. So you move, the AI moves, the barbarians move, you heal up, and then your turn begins. That's, that's the order. Runs working next, I think. He didn't attack me, bro. No, it attacked a stupid Ahsoka. Oh, and Ahsoka got lioned on. I'll fight the lion then. <laughs> Come on. No god lion today. That was enough. I only need 4 XP because I'm charismatic. Which is awesome. I need to go choke him quickly. He starts with the wheel. Which is dangerous. Gets a chariot really quickly if he has horses in his capital. Got gems over there. That's nice. I'm sure he's here somewhere though. Oh Jesus, man. What is with all these lions? Let me heal up before I go any further. You can do this to try and see if you can see their border. I don't see him anywhere he gets. Uh, lions are scary, man. I don't want to go near them. Nah. Holy shit, man. These animals. I'm gonna have to. That lion went poof, actually. What the hell? He must be, like, right here. Ah, there he is. Okay. Just gonna go here. I know it's safe from animals. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Good. Get the gold now. He's settled right there. What's going on in here? Archer, Archer, Settler. Already got a Settler. See, Immortal AI, turn 19 Settler, with a size 4 capital and improved double food. You don't get that on Emperor difficulty. This is a huge jump. Um, let's work that until the gold is done. I, I kind of want to grow. Yeah, work, grow before we work the gold. And I met... Ahsoka. Ready for action. Ah, he has to have an archer there, of course. Prick. Now they have, like, they start with, like, three archers. They can, technically, send a really early archer in and choke you. Which is really what you don't want. He's, they're kind of far away, though, which is good. Alright, alright, alright. I might go for this. This is ambitious, but cow and gems eventually would be awesome. I probably won't get to use him, to be honest, but... Nice defensive spot. We could have a shot at the pyramids even with the stone. Now I'll go here to deal with Gilgamesh. Or maybe just here. Less ambitious much more likely for Gilgamesh to push to that as well can work the gold at just size one chop units out it's not great get the cow one day but I'm sure it'll just get constantly pillaged to be honest I'm not too sure where I'm going to settle my boys Um, I would like to grab this floodplain region here, like on the hill here for Kubla. That would be nice on the hill there. Get the floodplains. I can just backfill another city like here to help work them and a bit more of a river there. Might be some city spots down here. Need to deal with Gilgamesh. I think Gilgamesh will be more of a problem than Kubla, so maybe I do go here first. And just put a thing there. Can work the lake. It's not terrible. Actually, yeah, I think on that spot first, maybe. All right. Need to make sure that's safe then. Why are you guarding your worker with a friggin' archer? Why are you a big brain?
What I'm doing is I'm walking around looking for copper. In the forest there's a chance he might attack me with his archer. So I'm going to go here. He can't reach me here. Also check the water and stuff. I don't know why not. Go here and then into the forest hill. Okay, we can work the gold actually. Let's do that. I'm just going to si stay size 3 and do my stuff now. And start chopping out the settler. So first things first, we're going to chop away... Probably these tiles that they can come in and bother me. Maybe this one. Well, no, I want to chop away one of these tiles here. I don't think they'll archer rush me yet. I chop here and chop here and then chop here, I think. Oh, I want to get rid of all four of these forests as soon as possible. Oh, he's going out with his friggin' settler. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, dude. Okay. It is entirely seemly for a young man killed in battle to lie mangled by the bronze spear. In his death, all things appear fair. Okay, hunting archery now immediately. I, want, I need to fortify archers in his city right here. Right, right here, man. I need an archer. I need to choke him. Oh man, he's already hooking up that copper. Look at him, dude. Doesn't have bronze working yet, but... Can't waste any time. He already plonked that city. Lion, if really? you chase two rabbits, you will lose them both. Reporting for duty. Yes. Not today, prick. Go check Gilgamesh too, I mean, with this guy, why not? Might be able to catch him before metal. He just got slavery, uh, he just got bronze working, he knows there's copper there now. I have to keep him away from that copper until I can get an archer in there. His worker went somewhere. Somewhere for me to grab. That'll... That's one way to keep him away from that. Good. Okay, we're gonna go bother Gilgamesh with our warrior in a minute. Before he can get some metal, hopefully. Okay, got that settler. Let's be honest, my worker is probably gonna die trying to get home. I'll need to escort him, but I can't leave him with that copper. We'll try like sneaking down here, but it's unlikely he'll be able to make it. Do not throw the arrow, which will return again. Okay, well that looks good. More important, I cut his metal off than it is to get that worker home. I think. I got copper here. That is a really good spot. Oh my god. Look at that. That is so cool. Okay. Archer. And what we're gonna do is... First we need to hook out... I don't have the wheel. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well we can start getting ready for that copper, I suppose. Um...
Oh, bro. Bro. Okay, I think I can go here and it should still scare his worker away from that tile. I'm gonna go through the jungly forest route here, a bit more safe. Yes. What's the plan? Chop until yes. I actually get the settler down. Oh, please tell me I can. 18, 17, 17, 17. I need the wheel. Well, it doesn't matter too much. I need to mine that anyway, but... Nah, whatever. It's going to be four turns, I think, no matter what I do. Yes? What do you need? Ah, <sighs> this freaking lion. Oh, you hear that? Freaking... Victory roar from the Wang game is threatening me, dude. Okay. Let's go straight to Mr. Kubla. I'm just pre chopping because I'm waiting to settle my city anyway. If there's like a panther there that kills my warrior, I will smash the desk. Why are you going that way, you freaking bimbo? I could chop this first, just to get a real quick archer in here and start fortifying. That might not be the stupidest idea ever, actually. Just a really quick archer, so I feel safe there. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Lions! Ah! Oh, no you don't. <laughs> uh, I will probably die if I take that guy now. Oh, I should have gone on the hill. He can actually get me there. Okay, it looks safe. If that was a wolf. Oh my god. I could really use that worker. I've got lots of roads and shit to build. Put your shoulder to the wheel. Yes. Flicking animal husbandry. I have a sheep. Ready for action. Ready for action. Okay, we got him home. That's nice. Need to find where Gilgamesh is sick. I could go choke Gilgamesh, honestly, with this guy. Because there's no one... It's really early and they're not harassing me yet. Two workers. Dude, I would love to get those two workers, bro. Maybe if I go here, he'll try to road this spot again. Two workers. Oh my god, man. Alright, he made it, thank god. He will road the gold, and then road the city up. He moved him. Oh, Mama! That's fine. He's got no workers left to improve his copper. Oh, he's got ivory. Good to know. Going there because he's only got three guys, it's unlikely he will attack me there. Possible, but unlikely. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna archer choke these bastards. 
And get two in there for Kublai, because he's so far away. Definitely hurts my economy, all these units, but it's worth it. Clip his road. He just made another one. Uh oh. Tell me what to do. Ready for action. What's the plan? Waiting your order. What's the plan? Make sure that tile remains neutral. Tell me what to do. And get that hooked up. Duty. Heck yeah. Your order. It's coming to get me. I'll go on the hill. Your order. Two for Gilgamesh. Ready for Two for Kublai. This one I'll have to deal with stupid barbarians because I didn't build the Great Wall. I could still go for it, couldn't I? Yeah, I could have a shot at it. Pump the archers, I don't care, man. We'll get some money back once we rode the cities up. What's the plan? Tell me what to do. What's the plan? One XP, is that even worth it? No, it just means I'll have to heal for 10 turns. If it gave me 2 XP, which is a promotion, then it would be worth it. But one is just whatever, dude. Went back in the city, the little punk. Your yeah, attack an archer in a forest. Good luck, bro. This guy's going for it too. Farm some XP. I should win that as well. Just go for it. What's the plan? Okay. That actually takes my unit cost down. I had to pay unit supply for my units there. All the workers and stuff, but that'll help me a bit now that they're home. Hopefully I win that. I should have really good odds. Like a 3 versus 2. Yeah. Just farming XP to get some promotions. Drill guys early. Yeah, I escort my archer to the hill there. Two guys on the tile. Smash this mine. Need to find his worker. Okay, he's got a worker in there. Yeah, just explore down here. Oh yeah, see we've got good stuff down here. That's not too shabby at all. What do you need? Good soundtrack, okay. At your service. Do that because why not? I can't get to the sheep no, anyway, but I'll be able to get to the sheep from there. I got four workers, man. Gaming. I think I chop out an axe before your anything else. I think I put the warrior in the capital and the archer is in there. 
I don't think I should finish that guy. I think I should chill a bit. Don't want to pay too much. Let's start on an Axeman, actually. At your service. I want two archers right next to that copper in the hill on the forest. He will never, ever get me out of there. Well, service. actually, I want to stop him from selling any more cities, too, if possible. I don't want him trying to go around me. He might build a settler in here and then think he can go down here. I want to get this spot. Like this, this is a gorgeous spot. No, even here would be even better. Maybe it won't actually. Not here. Stone, cow, gems. I, I want it, dude. I can pin him down. I can sop up all of this territory. You know, it'll be mine. My precious. I probably shouldn't be doing that, I should be chopping. He moved his settler somewhere. What? Okay, dude. The archer alone should be enough for a while. We'll go see what else he's up to. Where did that worker go? Aha! A settler, rather. Oh, and I got away with it too. How do you like that? You got horses right there. We gotta make sure he doesn't ever get a chance to hook that up. Excellent. Take out the road. He can't attack my archer there. I have like 75% bonus. I think it's worth paying a few extra gold per turn to completely cripple these bastards. Put the worker there again, dude. Do it. Fall for the trap again. He did it. Oh. Never mind. <laughs> he, he expanded his mind. Shit. Uh, Pericles is not too bad of a guy, though. <sighs> okay. Might do that. Yeah. Get pottery a bit quicker working that tile. Yes. Get a mine for some more stuff. What's the plan? Yes. Gilgamesh might have a third city. Very possible. Because we haven't seen his workers all that much. Kubla is stuck, though. Okay. Built some workers. What do you need? Um. Okay. I 
I'll send the Axemen over to Gilgamesh. And hopefully my warrior and two archers can kind of lock him down completely. I don't want to go too far out there and meet everyone who I kind of already have, but... Um, I have... I've kind of forgotten about settling cities, and I didn't build units, did I? No, I got this guy, actually. It should be okay. Mm. I think I'll go for that spot. It's, it's a nice spot, dude. Looks like they're all gonna come through here to attack me. I mean, I might even... Oh, imagine that. That's the ultimate choke spot to defend. Boy, I would kind of like to get that. I could just fortify everyone in there against the rest of the world. And have like a few here and I'd be able to see if they go around and stuff. That would be awesome if I could do that. I think I don't need to go for that because I'm kind of holding Kublai down. But there's like barbarians and stuff running around down there, so... Alright, if I go for that, I can make a Pyramids play and that might be alright. I'll need to get Mysticism anyway. I'll go for that because I don't actually have a unit fog busting down there, that's my mistake. Um... Yeah, sucks. If I could get that, I might just fortify a friggin' arch on that hill. Make sure I get it. It'd be a great spot to defend from the rest of these bastards. So here's the thing, if you start right next to them, they will actually attack you really early if they can. But if you start far away like this, it might be a bit more forgiving. I had some horrible luck in previous attempts where I'm like right next to so many people, I didn't choke all of them and then I get Chariot and Dog Soldier rushed at 2000 BC. Worst thing about starting next to Sitting Bull is you can't even stop him from building Dog Soldiers since he can make him without metal. And yeah, he'll just come at you with, with them. I need to make sure he doesn't get those horses too and Kashyyyk me. He might go for that. Hath not the potter power over the clay to make one vessel unto honor and another unto dishonor? Oh shit, I get gang banged there. Although the AI will move first and he'll go, do I want to attack him? No, and then the barbarian will attack me and then he's already moved so he can't get me. Okay, a couple cottages would really be nice to get up and running. Um spot appears to be pretty safe. We'll send a worker over here and start rooting I think. We'll use you to start cottaging. You can actually go up there. Early access to copper is really good. Go for a worker. Uh, do I really need more workers? Honestly just a settler and I'll even chop him out. Expand quick. I could just build like more units and slowly grow another axe for example. Barracks even. Go for barracks for now. Ooh. Well I kind of want to get to mysticism but let's make some units. I'll have that tile anyway to help me. Oh yeah shit. I might want to work that to be honest for a little bit. Even do that and just chill a bit. Need to tech. Yeah, yeah, double star promotion, you prick. Keep watching if he builds any settler. He might go up there and get those horses. Get the 
freaking cottage going here? Archer and an axe will do for now and they are. I can give the pyramids a shot. It's coming to bother me here. I don't trust Gilgamesh though. He's trying to get his horses on. That's not allowed. Just scare him. Taking the work will probably get me killed. Not sure what stupid Kubla is up to. Dude, get out of here. You're, you're so freaking dead. Ready for action. What do you need? Yes? It's got a settler. Here comes a Gilgamesh archer. All present and accounted for. Please send you to help out with All the road. And I want to chop this away so they can't fortify in it. Oh shit. I forgot about that guy. God dang it. Completely forgot about that. Alright, well, I'll need to make another one. That is my bad. I completely forgot about that. He nearly killed my axeman. Holy shit. Reporting for duty. Waiting your Reporting orders. For duty. Waiting your orders. Should have been more careful there. I've completely forgot. That's why you don't queue a unit to move. It's unlikely he'll attack. There's only three guys in there. They only do that if they have too many in the city. Not time for granaries yet. I need a couple more units. Alright, I'm gonna go here. I don't want him getting me. Reporting for duty. If he misbehaves, I can get him out of there with an axeman. Getting these mines built for when I do go for the mids. He's got a settler there. I'm not really checking him the best. I'm not in his face enough. I'm in his capital, but his other city's like free to breathe. Nature herself has imprinted on the minds of all the, the idea of God. Reporting for duty, all present and accounted for. Maybe axe first. Um, go Archer for now. Waiting your orders. Hey, I'm not sure if he's going to go for that. He might. Where did that guy go? All present oh, cottaging planes. Smash that. We need to build a monument here now. And chop that. 
Gonna try for the pyramids. Might not happen, but it's worth a shot. Have forests, I have workers. Might be his only city. I don't think it is, though. Like these guys being here. Reporting for duty. I can get the archer in this forest though. And yeah, let's get this gold going. I won't be able to work the copper and the gold, although if I farm this, that'll change everything, so we'll go ahead and do that. Need to get to masonry next. It's not too bad. The gold is really carrying my economy, that's for sure. Chop that as well. I don't think I bother with the granary. I've grown heaps already. Um, we can do the granary later. But I'm going to go for the mids once I get some enough guys out. Just build units for now. Doing a pretty good job at choking so far. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, we really can't have him putting turns into that. Prick. I think this guy's coming to choke me anyway. I'll wait right here and see where he goes. I have this axe as well I can use. Just healing him. Yes. Should heal in the city. It's better, isn't it? Maybe do that. Um, yeah. Yeah, it does look like he's coming this way. We'll go here so we can't go forest to forest block him, so he'll have to come in the open field. If he comes in the open field, I'm going to clobber him with my axe. Yes. I need to get on that tile. I will settle a city there. Your orders. As you... Just want to be careful not to overstretch too much here. Present and accounted for, present and accounted for. Wow. Well, there could be someone right here who's like expanding here. I'd, I want this spot. This is an awesome choke to hold. Really want that. I'll also go here so Gilgamesh doesn't come through with his little bastard over there. We'll just keep chopping. Oh, India's right there. Just skill commission is two workers here. What did he build? Another worker? Okay, they're kind of bothering me now. But I already got the granary out, so that's fine. Yes? Okay, focus commerce and just get me like one more archer while we wait for masonry. This is better. Across the river if he wants to try to move there. Cut his cities off. Also nice. Just double fortify there, like Unless that settler moves. I, I need to keep checking it though, so I'm gonna use the skip turn so it keeps waking me up every turn. Hello. Wow. Okay. 
ambitious. Dude, he's doing it. Almost. Jesus Christ. Okay, the other one kind of went away, which is good. I've got an axe here now, though, so... We'll be okay. Um, I need to hang out here because we've got to improve the quarry. I'm not sure if he sent out a settler. Did he have a... He might have had a settler here. We'll go zoom around with our guy, Zumzumakasha, over to him. Hello, doofus. Yeah, this is much better. Some games I had to deal with swordsmen attacking my cities already at this point. But I'm choking the two warmongers, to be honest. The other three guys are relatively peaceful. They don't go for techs like bronze working and iron working early. And they don't build a lot of units. I'm choking the two guys that are dangerous. So this is pretty good. I noticed fortified two archers in that forest next to his freaking capital. What's he going to do about that? Or maybe Archer and an Axeman. I'm going to walk around here with my Axeman and see what he's got cooking, though. Okay, that guy could probably go up there, too. Granary. Maybe Monument first. This is a good start, though. This is perfect. I mean, I have a really nice start here, but... I'm not playing a financial leader, so the gold is actually really nice to have. It is from their foes, not their friends. We're playing something that's harder than Didi, so I don't really feel bad about using a gold start for it. Okay, we don't want to finish chopping that. We'll save that for the mids. What we do want to do is finish the quarry. Fucking four turns, really, man? Well, we can give this a shot since it hasn't gone yet. If I could get that, that would be awesome, actually. I will chop it. I don't care. I'll try and kill that Diddy Dazu. Let's see if he's settled anything over there. Block that choke off. He's coming here, but he's not going to be able to do anything. I think I'll pillage that and get away with it. Camp to that as well. Oh, hey. Boy, I could move this guy here. Ready for action. Look at that, man. All present and accounted for. I could risk this guy if I moved him here. Oh, I already have this guy. What the freaking hell? Um, I kind of could use more workers at this point, to be honest. Let's try to get him out of there, then. I don't think I need... So I could totally go there. <laughs> yeah, but if he whips an archer and attacks me, which they do do sometimes, then he's dead, so no. Um, the easiest way for this worker to get out is to go here and then use our archer, so we'll, we'll do that. I don't think he will attack me there with all my archers outside his city like that. Oh, hey, buddy. Don't mind me, bro. Let's actually try to build this thing to more hammers. We can chill. We don't need any more tech for a little while. Yeah, I'm not too worried about that guy. I'm fortified here. Okay, he's sending a guy to me. Come at me. Ah, yeah. Gilgamesh. Okay, good, good, good. We found his third city. That's, that's, that's really important. He hasn't had a chance to connect it, but he might even have metal there. Alright, can this guy... There's three turns to get there. I don't think that will make much of a difference. I don't think it will, no. 
No, it's not going to change it. We're going to be done here in three turns anyway, so... Let's just chop. Chop the Great Wall and then chop the mids. He's just being a prick there, that's fine. I have a lot over there. I wouldn't mind another guy here, to be honest. Especially since they're going to attack me there. Hmm. Now. At your service. His workers went somewhere. Somewhere up there. I think they went to the new city. That's safe. Reporting for duty. What am I doing? Your orders. Go attack him. I can even bring this guy home, to be honest, if I have an Axeman in there. Don't want to have too many units, they're expensive to pay for, you know? What do you need? Aha. Uh -huh. Trying to road your city, bro. Oh, don't you try to slip through. No, 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 you don't. You stay away. I'm gonna go pillage his tiles with the axe. That'll actually help fund my improvements a bit. Um, that's fine. Yeah, just chop like an animal. Chop everything. Ready for action. Make sure we have the stone up before we finish the chop. One archer, huh? Very well. Take out these roads while we're here. We're doing really good job at choking these guys. They are so screwed. Like he might be high in score, but that's just just because he's got a lot of land. Like he's got no metal. He's not improving his tiles. He's got no horses, no ivory. Even he's not having a good time. Okay, this guy, I'm gonna... Yes! Ready for action. Hold on a minute, I'm not sure what that punk wants though. Um... What's the plan? Right. You need to be ready What's for these the guys and their chokes. Tell me what to do. The way I see it, in combat odds, when, you're t when you take a fight that's between 30 and 70%, it's honestly just a 50-50. From my experience, anything between 30 and 70, it's just a 50-50 the way this game treats it, so. But that was pretty good that we won that, that's for sure. If I can get the Great Wall, that would be awesome. I'm in only four more turns. Very late Great Wall, but that's okay. Wonder where that settler's gonna go. Do that while I'm doing Great Wall in here. Getting into those ancient vibes, bro. Yeah, I don't like this guy at all. I have two archers here to defend that. Let's chop that. Got the Great Wall, hopefully. Try and chop that too. No. So the fact I got two woodsmen, two guys, is 
pretty insane. Yes. Holy shit. This is the ultimate choke guy now. Excellent. Excellent. That is so good to get that this late. 100% great general emergence and barbarians are my friends now, essentially. Big mistake, buddy. Didn't see that coming, did ya? That is so good that I got that. It's really late and really lucky I got it that late. But I don't care, that is, that is awesome. That is, that is so good. So now every fight that happens in my borderlands will give me double great general points. That's what that means. Makes you imperialistic for free, basically, in always war. Only in your border when they fight, but... Because it's always war, all the fights are gonna be right here. Okay, now let's chop the hell out of this bastard right now. I don't care if you go unhealthy, we can... ...deal with that later. Um, you can grow... Do I really want a granary here? I don't think I do. I want to pump units and just work the cottages temporarily. Got marble too, I didn't even notice that. How cool is that? Holy shit, I can do all sorts of things. I think I will go aesthetics later. We can build wonders like a bastard. Hell yeah, man. Okay, no one's there, so I'm gonna go ahead and chop chop. Now we're fine like this until they finally tech their way to longbows. Who do I want to watch? Maybe like Willem or something. He's pretty high up there in the score. Can't trust him and his mustache. Yeah, rap is really, really good if we can get that. Okay. Good luck. I'm protective on a hill, fortified. But yeah, sure, man. What are they doing? Oh, he blocked me, dude. He blocked me. That's not very nice. Go pillage your tiles because he did that, you bastard. I wanted to steal more workers, man. Charismatic promotions are awesome. Um, yeah, that's a gold pet turn saved. <laughs> Paying a lot. Look at that. 12 unit cost. Holy shit. And supply. But I'm saving so much. Bullshit that can potentially happen here by choking these morons. That's it's really good. Boom, ba -da -boom, ba -da -boom, boom. Yes. Chop, chop. Um, we need to chop, yeah. Chop, chop. Chop, chop. Get those pyramids up. Honestly, you can probably just go for a settler. I'll go and settle that right now. A bit slow, but I have two archers in here now. It should be fine. Is there any... No, that's probably the best tiles to work. I mean, I could farm that. Might do that for one turn. Until I find something better. I think I can get the mids with these forests. It should be enough. Need to keep these bastards away. Look, look, look at this guy. He, he can't be there. I'm trying to chop pyramids, you know. Ooh, 
One worker went in the city, one's decided to continue roading. Let's get some money for ourselves to get to riding. Gilgamesh has a settler on the move. Honestly, just put down a cottage so I don't die. It's probably more important right now. At your service. Stop improving the ivory. Who said you could do that? Who said you could do that? I don't think I said you could do that. I don't think you can do that. Tell me what to do. Lose if I take that. Tell me what to do. I'm waiting your orders. Try and stop them coming in by blocking them off like that. On our way. That was a mistake. He fucked up. <laughs> Almost there! My health is almost dead as well. A city! I can get a few cities out of this. That... is probably one. And then like something over here, probably number two, like that for example, or one more down. Yeah, I, I, like, I like that a lot. One more forest to chop. That'll be the last one. Get back on the hill. Just chilling here. I need to improve this city, of course, but... Might be able to get there with all the workers... With all the improvements I'm going to pillage. I don't... How many workers do I have? I might have too many. I don't think I need all of these guys. How many do I have? I have to pay for them, that's the problem. Five for three cities. I don't think I need... I think five for three cities is enough. It, you see, two gold per turn for those workers. I kind of need my money right now. Oh, get away. Ready for action. All present and accounting for duty. Ready for action. Awaiting your orders. Awaiting your orders. Yes? All present and accounted for. Reporting for duty. Sheesh, man, I've chopped every single freaking thing down. It's really killing me. Um, What's the plan? We'll go road the corn up. I have corn and cow and... Yes. Wheat. We should be fine. Hello. Dude! Friggin' idiot. I've just choked them so hard, they're just like broken and can't even breathe at this point. I don't want them though, it's too expensive. I, I'll take them later, I don't need them right now though. I could get that one too, but I feel like that'll backfire. This is how you choke the AI though. I am... I've completely stuffed both of them. I'm so happy I was able to do that. Yeah, he's being a bastard. Yeah, the barbarians are gonna go to him now because they can't enter my territory! <laughs> uh, love that. Alright, I don't want you going on that tile. Smashy smashy. Thanks for the money. I don't think your settler's allowed to move, bro. That should be the last one. And yeah, we wanna 
fix the health situation a bit. That didn't do anything, apparently. Oh, it's already connected. Shit. My health is really that bad. Alright, um, we need the wheat. I will expand like crazy once I get mids and rep. That'll keep us going, hopefully. And we'll cottage these bastards and work them. Yes. He did have an archer here. I want to get a city down here if I can. Yeah, you guys your do your crap. What's the plan? Um. The other guys will attack me eventually, no doubt about that. I'm kind of blocking their paths, but we have vision at least. to go down here next. It's got cow and stuff. I'll snipe that guy if he goes on my horses there. This guy... Okay, India sending an arch over it. It's very nice of the rest of them to behave. It's because they're so far away and they're probably putting less emphasis on it. Got another settler there. True glory consists in doing what deserves to be written. In writing what deserves to be read. Can we not get that any faster? Probably not actually. I kinda screwed myself up here. I should have like kept that forest there alive a bit longer. Might honestly lose the mids for that. Would kind of suck, wouldn't it? Get in territory so I can stop paying for you. I don't like this guy though. Um, he can't do anything too bad, but to still annoying. Your See if Kublai will donate some more workers for us. It's going great so far though. This is really good. This is even better than the friggin' Wang game. Okay, we want lit. Oh, we'll go for monarchy, but I got the pyramids, dude. I'll do slavery and rep together. Can't believe I'm not even in slavery yet. Really unhealthy, which sucks, but. Smash the improvements, fund my research a bit, if they want to donate me some gold. He sent them off there, okay. Could go here to use that tile, but no, I think I'd rather that. Food. I don't want him piss farting around down here, I'm trying to settle a city here. We're gonna go full settler pump in a minute. As soon as I... Man. Hold on. Oh man, yeah, I really need more food, don't I? Jesus. Alright, well... It's gonna be two turns no matter what, might as well do that, could use the money. Not too bad. Uh, definitely a strain on the economy, you can really feel it. We did get writing though, we can do a library here. And the settler here, wait, what? Oh! oh I need to take this guy out. That was lucky, but I was prepared to lose and just do some damage and finish him off with the second one. That was really lucky though. This would actually be a really good heroic epic spot because it's... It's got three hills, a cow and a horse tile, quarry even. It's way out here in the middle of my enemies, which is honestly good. Did I settle one in here? No, okay. Yeah, I think I settle him here though. This will be where I pump my units out of. 
that'll give me immediate beakers with rep too. Okay, that's yes. good. Um, I did want a worker up there though, this yes. should have been that guy, but anyway. Bit lucky there, but as I said, 30 is the same as 50. 70 is the same as 50. Because you know how many times I lose at 70%, I feel like it's just all the same. Because I win at 30 quite a lot too. I feel like it's a bit rigged and it's just all 50-50. It's all um... I don't know, man. I want this guy to go away, though, that's for sure. I guess pre chop that. Got it. And some fail gold, because I put some hammers into it in the other city. That gives us rep. Excellent frigging start. Yeah. Getting my own fail gold here. Jesus Christ. Um, honestly, I'm just going to whip a granary here. I think it'll be more healthy to just whip that. Move out. Tempting, but no. Ah, you have fun with that. <laughs> Barbarians are my friends. way too slow. It's because we're minus three here. I'm gonna whip this bastard. You know what? Yes. Tell me what to do. Got a plan for yes. what to do with my poor little capital. Okay, I could actually use some more workers now. Anyone want to donate some? Maybe. Got a Barb City actually defending me there. Dude, the Barbarians are like my special alliance. Holy! Tell me what to Jesus do. Christ. <laughs> oh yeah, I do need that guy. Cheers. Ready for action. Don't think he'll attack. If I put the archer there, that is. All present and accounted for. Oh, yeah, I kind of need to get him out of there. Whipping this because it's really unhealthy, the granary will give it health and allow me to like, grow- No, 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 what I wanted to do was farm that. I'm gonna actually farm this just so I can grow and whip my infrastructure out.
quickly. I think that's the best way to do it, to be honest with you. Um... Oh, you're stupid, dude. You're, you're really, you're really stupid. Solomon. Okay, there we go. Now we, we grow like champions in here. I kind of need the farms because I'm working a gold mine and that's already significantly slowing down my, my growth. workers ah might be time to go for that I'll need to put more units there though might be a bit too risky I might do that with the guy here we'll just we'll just put this one here for now and get that nice easy spot there that's really good to get he barely won that dude oh he went here shit okay that's cheeky. The one turn I step away from this tile, he squeezes... Squeezes out. Hopefully there's no iron right there. It doesn't look like it, or we'd see suspicious yield. But, okay. Nice one, you little bastard. Pre-rode that. Oh shit. Okay. He's mad, that's for sure. Now I've got a cover guy with drill two. That should clap his cheeks though. Leave the archer there. The axeman is gonna make sure he's not up to anything sus down here. Could really use that. Thanks, bro. He might have a lot of units in there. That's risky. Oh, no, he doesn't. Shit, I could have taken that guy. I have to, unfortunately, retreat here one turn away from the pasture. That sucks. Just in case I have to put that guy in the city, I suppose you can do that. Tell me what to do. Frederick is the last guy, okay. The race of the immortal gods and the race of men who walk upon the earth. really helping with the money. Grow while we do that. Settling that, imagine. Tell me what to do. I think he's angry, and I think he wants to kill my axeman. He's brought shock archers. <laughs> he's bringing shock archers to get me. It's like really mad. Can't really blame him. Okay, got that worker. That's that's nice. Back you go to your post. Yeah, still only one guy in here. He won't attack, I don't think.
Okay, that's... Yeah, it doesn't want me going bankrupt, does it? Yeah, just work the farm later then. Have a good happy cap. Look at that happy cap. Freaking rep. Maybe this gold mine here is worth it. I need to grow my cities. Do I have a granary here? No. We'll get this axe out and go for granary. I think he can help chop that out. He might just go for it next turn. I think I will win that. I think I will win that. Um, yeah, I should win that. No way he wins. Look how many bonuses I have. I'm literally like strength 10 in there. He's gonna go for it though. I don't, I don't think he has a chance here. I know he outnumbers me, but it shouldn't be possible. Even when my archers are at one strength, they will still be stronger than him. That's my cover guy. I just killed two guys and barely got touched, you see? It's like a longbow on a hill. That's the second guy. That's my second archer, right? We'll, we'll look at the combat odds later, but I should still win this. Oh! He got really lucky there. He won at 2%, you see what I mean? 0 0.0, 0 0.1, 0 0.3, he won at 2% though, which is really fucking stupid, but... Okay. Um, that just means I need to chop an archer. Don't panic. It means that chop has to go into a freaking archer, apparently, because I got completely screwed there. I need to make sure Willem doesn't fortify there. That is so lucky, man. 2%. But yeah, I mean, it was enough anyway to hold it. Shouldn't have lost that. Whatever. Didn't lose the city. It's fine. Take his workers as a punishment. What's the plan? Ready for action. He's getting a bit frisky. Yes. <coughs> yes. <coughs> 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 Um... Reporting for duty. Well, they're not coming down here. The Axemen should be up there at the front line. What do you need? And... Yeah, my economy stinks, I know. You can go help out in here, I suppose. I have a lot of guys here already, but whatever. Two guys here, I'm gonna settle them. Just getting ready for that. Oh, you bastards. Didn't think they'd screw me again after I just lost at 2%, so. Yeah, yeah. Look at that, Medic 2. Uh, whatever, dude. That's so bullshit. I died to that, but yeah. 2%, bro. All present and accounted for. What's the plan? Freddy, you're in the way, man. I wonder if he'll punish me if I do that. It's not worth it, I think. I, I could lose that, or I could get badly wounded, and he probably will punish me, and no need for that crap. I'm not going to be able to choke Gilgamesh forever. He will eventually get somewhere. Might be able to choke Kublai forever though. I can't let him get those horses, I have to keep an eye on that. Um, only two guys in there, he won't attack me. Do I need all these workers once again? Paying a lot of money. How many workers do we have? We have... We have five in domestic now. We have two in enemy territory. We have one in neutral territory. Where's the neutral one? Here. Just got this guy home. Ready for 
Um, let's go take these assholes out. I'm sick of their shit. Get this library. Chop something else in there. I'll try to improve that tile again. I think... I'll delete one worker. I'll get another one later when I need it. Right now, I don't need them that badly. Got a settler in there. I don't know where he thinks he's going to go. I mean, he might try to go here, which is fine. I couldn't care less. Um, that guy in there can take care of everything. He'll chop the granary and... Once we grow, settle more cities, work more cottages, we'll recover, we'll have more unit cost and unit supply, support or whatever. We'll be okay. Let's start mining that, that'll be nice as well. Help us a bit. Might send that archer to go choke him too at some point. Chop and then cottage. He's pulling out. It's fine. I get this nice tile now. What do you need? What's the plan? Definitely not worth it at this point. <sighs> okay, 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 okay. We're doing granary here. Um, what is this? not be loaded. Swear to God, dude. If he tries to, like, settle here. Move one guy off. Try and scare him. Let's pillage that. Um... Oh, okay. Feeling confident after your 2%, bro, and he's going for it again. I don't know what that galley's doing, it's just being an idiot, I guess. He never improved his pig. That's good, I'm like totally choking him. I believe you've got some roads to fix, Kublai. Now my axe will sort out this bullshit. I should actually chop away these forests. Might save them for Great Library or Parthenon or something though, to be honest. Pericles will actually go early, Parthenon. Of course. That's what he lives for. Let's grow. Very, very late oracle. I could have got that if I wanted it. I'm not too worried about that guy. I do have an axeman here. And I'll use that. I need to get this. Well, I will get it with wrap in a minute. Just trying to grow my cities and we're prioritizing food. But I, I will get that stuff in a bit. We're gonna have gold mines work being worked. We're gonna have cottages. We're gonna have everything. I'm just we're chilling. We don't have to rush. Oh shit. Okay. That's really good that I found that before he hooked it up. 
definitely iron right there. Um, let's put an archer right there to be safe even. I'll just chop guys out of here, I don't care, but I need to make sure he does not hook that up no matter what. He cannot have that iron. I will not let him have that iron tile. I'll chop that then. Protect that with that guy. I will want ironworking eventually for the gems, of course. But... This stuff has to wait. Come on, dude. Go build more workers. I know you want to. I have to keep my warrior there. I can't let him hook that up. I'm really happy I found that, though. That's so... That's so good. Holy shit. Temple of Artemis for fail gold? Sure, man. Why not? Um, let's do Sattler here and Artemis in here then. I'll even chop into it. I don't care. Go ahead and build it, you bastards. I think I'll... I'll get the Sattler out and then start making my move toward that. That would be even better, wouldn't it? Game? Well, I think that's fine. Um, two turns, seven turns. Yeah, work the one that's two turns away. This granary is... Is it worth whipping? Not yet. No, I don't think it is. It will slow build by the time the food bar's half. That's perfect, actually. Otherwise, if I whip it, it'll be size three and have to all grow all the way back up. But if I just let it slow build, it'll be done in four turns and it'll be like half full. That's way faster or way better. Oh wow, he really wants to get me off here. Okay, bro. Swordsman? Oh, Ahsoka Swordsman. Ah. Okay. So yeah, the, this is what I mean. This is why I brought archers here, not just warriors. The AI are sending units through to choke me. Oh, not to choke me, but to attack me. And if I if they see like a warrior, they will kill it. But if I have like an archer fortified fully, they might think twice. Even better, an axeman. I will stay right here until those units pass, but I'm not going to be able to choke them much longer. Because of that. that. Chop that. Yeah. Dun 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 where did he go? Might be there. Yeah, I think he's there. He won't go there. It doesn't help him actually get to me any faster by going on that tile because he was here. Go here or he can go here. I think he went here. And that's because it puts him, you know, you see this, it's making me go through the forests automatically. That's what he's done. He's basically like rack clicked on my city. You see, what's the fastest way to get there? Go through all the friggin' forests. That's what he's done, and it's gonna like, he's gonna go there, 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 there. I do want that archer here though. Um, there's a chance Ahsoka might attack me, and then Gilgamesh might clean me up. I don't really want that. I need, also need to figure out where Ahsoka is going to attack. It's either this one or this one. And honestly, I don't know until they get to here, which is kind of a problem. Um, 
I'll need to keep units within two turns of both cities here, basically. That's what we're gonna do. Chop that bastard. It's gonna get me some fail gold and help me tech a bit. I'm not even paying that much. I'm paying a bit, but it's not that bad. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I think we can do... No, never mind. Do, 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 Let's do that. Economy's starting to come online, guys. It's starting. You know what? Run these bastards. I mean, I'm, I'm getting there, you know. Uh, look at look how fast I can go when I turn it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. The rep economy is coming online, my friends. The sun is rising over my shitty economy. And honestly, if I don't want to whip it, maybe do that while I'm waiting for that cottage to be built. And now do that. And that should be almost perfect. Do, 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 do. This Artemis will give me good money. I'll oh, get a Spire and Engineer. Both are going to be pretty interesting. That's honestly a bad spot to put a cottage. That is going to get pillaged. I don't even think that's worth working. Well, I'll do it anyway. I want to grow. Chop is 40 gold, I'll take it. I wanted to build the Great Library there, but... Oh well. Build it here, maybe. I need those forests gone so they don't fortify there. I could go ironworking first. Everyone has ironworking, and I can get that really quick. But no, I think I'll go aesthetics and get fail gold from Parthenon and stuff. I want to make a push to lit before it's too late. Get the Great Library with my marble. Get fail gold from Parthenon. Swaggity Pyre, Fail Gold, we'll get all of it, man. I do need to get some Settlers out, but we're working on that. If I, reminds me I need a Settler here too, we can chop twice. I want one guy here, and then one guy here, and then that is enough. That is six solid cities. And I could even squeeze out another one here if I really want. Maybe I should check for fish. But um, that's pretty good. Alright, well, I'm really satisfied with this opening. Finally had a good run. I've had a lot of freaking bad Always War runs. Oh my god, dude. He's crazy. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back.